Ever heard of that sound before? Well, then maybe you've had a joke fly over your head. Because that's the sound a joke makes when it flies right over your head. And you don't see it, you don't see it, nor do you realize it. Because it. I've never had a joke flow, uh, fly over my head. So I don't think I can relate to any of these posts or any of what you guys think. So we're gonna react to others. Rea <laughs> so we're gonna react to other people whose head joke flew over. Yes. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna react to other people who don't understand the joke, who think that they're just way beyond the joke and that their understanding and their IQ is just way more powerful than the joke itself. So let's begin. Guys who can lift a hundred kilograms of steel. Me. Guys who can only lift a hundred kilograms of feathers. <laughs> so weak. Get out of my face. Uh, this doesn't make any sense. Lol. 100 kilograms is 100 kilograms, regardless of the material. I would be very curious to see someone lifting 100 kilograms of feathers. The volume of the bundle would be enormous. <laughs> they are the same. Heartbroken. Our lack of knowledge and our, our lack of and our, us being dumb is so heartbreaking to this guy. He's just way beyond us. He's just so powerful that it breaks his heart to see people be so dumb. Wee Seems like the joke just flew over your head, you dumbass. Camouflage pants are getting better and better. Guys, don't be fooled. It's photoshopped. There are no invisible pants. What do you mean? Wait, what? There's no pants there? Bruh, she's sitting? Wait. I thought they were camouflage pants. Wait, what the hell? This is actually insane. Okay, it says, okay, I guess I didn't have high enough IQ. I thought, I thought she was, I thought she had invisible legs or something. Okay, so thank you, thank you guys for telling me that uh, it's Photoshop or that she's sitting on the thing. Thank you, I really needed to know that because I really thought she had invisible legs there. Two jokes that flew over your head. How about that, huh? How about that? The four horsemen of lies. So that was an effing lie? Liar! These bastards lied to me. Um, there's only three of them? You, whoever made this post, you're dumb. Like, I am way too smart for you. I know how to count, okay? You said there are four horsemen of lies, but you only put three. And it's not a weird coincidence that they're all saying liar. Hum. I just have so much IQ that I just went directly to the numbers involved because that's all I listen to. That's all I look at. I'm all binary in my head. You know, I'm all binary, hexadecimal. I am a computer. <laughs> Joke just flew over your head, boy. Even a computer isn't strong enough for the R slash whoosh community. I am performing on stage tomorrow. B break a leg. <laughs> Blocked. I'm not gonna let you break my legs. I am gonna perform on stage tomorrow and there's nothing you can do about it, okay? There's- I will not let you stand in between me and my goals. I will do what I want. You can't tell me to break a leg. <laughs> I'm just gonna block you so that you will never, ever be able to break my legs again. Ha! How about that, huh? You're sad, aren't you? You're scared that I'm chasing my dreams and you're just sitting there typing up on a computer and hating on me. Ha! <laughs> Take that. Dang, it's crazy to think that the world was black and white back then. Thank god the scientists invented color. I'm 11 years old, okay, I'm only 11, and I've known since I was 7 there was color back then. There was color in the 40s. Yup, there was obviously color, and scientists did not invent color. You missed the whole point of the comment, but since you're 11, it's okay, buddy. That's like those jokes where before scientists, before water was invented, and then you show like a bunch of brisks drinking. <sighs> brisk drinking dumbasses, you know? Come on, half of these, I just like. Is it really serious? Like, is it really? Are you really commenting that? Like, how do you not understand the joke? Like, am I the only one that thinks that? Is that just because I'm on this r slash wish subreddit and I know that they're gonna be jokes? I don't know, honestly. How did the first person code their compiler, though? Think about that. Hey, that's actually a question that I've had for a long time. How did the first coding language ever exist? Wouldn't you have to code that? How did you code it? 
Let's see if I can get my answer. Bill Gator? Yeah. Bill Gatekeeper? I don't know. He googled. How? There wasn't Google, dumb as. That was a effing joke. I still didn't get my answer. That was just the most terrible joke I've ever heard. I don't even know how can that can be an r slash wish. That's an r slash wish for everyone. That is, I guess the joke flew over my head too. It's just a terrible joke. I, I don't know what to tell you. You've heard of contact lenses, but have you heard of contactless lenses? <laughs> <laughs> so dumb, I can't wait. I can't wait to see what someone com commented on this. <laughs> yes, I did. They're called glasses. You dumbass, how did you not think? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, that's not contactless glasses. There's still contact on your ears and your nose, okay? I'm, I I'm are wishing myself, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> My Uber drivers got an attitude. SMH. <laughs> Getting arrested and taking a photo of the cop. <laughs> don't play him. A, don't pay him a single penny. And give. You might want to save that phone. Uh, hun. Dude, that's a cop. <laughs> oh no! How? How can you be so this dumb? How? <laughs> oh my god. Don't pay him a single penny. He's got such a bad attitude. Don't even tell him to not even be an Uber driver. Like, how can you have so much attitude while serving people? Ugh, that's disgusting. Disgusting behavior. I would not give him a single penny, even if he wants to arrest me. I don't care what he wants. Listen, okay? Listen, I'm not gonna give you a penny. I don't care if you're a cop or not. You're, you're giving me a. You're driving me to a place. I'm not gonna give you a single penny if you have attitude, okay? If you arrest me, that's it. Your job is gone. Whoosh! Knock knock. Yo! No, that's not how it goes. You have to say who's there. Let's try this again. Knock knock. Oh ha 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 ha. Okay, who's there? Honeydew. Lol. Anyway, <laughs> what's up? <laughs> oh no! I hate. I would. I would just. If that's my friend, my friend did that to me, and they were, uh, if she's literally, like, if she's serious right now, come on, you can't be serious. If she's serious right now, I will just ghost you for the rest of your life. Come on, yeah, block her, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> block her, just, just never talk to her again. I'm sorry, I know it might be a really harsh thing to do, just, n just don't talk to her again. That's what I would do. I don't care if I'm mean, I just, I can't live with someone like this in my life. <laughs> I'm a terrible person. I'm sorry. I'm sure you guys know this by now. Okay, Tom gets hurt. BTS has been real quiet since this dropped. <laughs> Bruh, BTS didn't exist when. <laughs> when <laughs> oh no. Okay, maybe this is not a good post to be uh, looking at. I think I'm gonna just click away now before this gets really bad. <laughs> this mother trucker's middle name is Jenkins. No, it's moving. Hall, moving s castle. If you read the books, it's actually his last name. I shall spoil no more. Read the books. <laughs> no! No! How could you? How? How could you? Oh my god. It's actually his last name. That's not even a spoil. Like, what the hell? Is <sighs> I'm losing hope, man. I'm st I'm really losing hope in humanity now. I, I don't know if I can go on with any more. I guess I shall build the courage to do one more. I agree. We should arrest all children, regardless of sk <laughs> what. My mom is a prosecutor, and every year she brings up the f fact that Mother's Day is a day with the lowest crime. I think that says a lot about how many moms commit crimes throughout the year, but can't today because they're too busy being celebrated. No, it's proof that even criminals love their mothers and behave for that day to honor and spend time with her. <laughs> that's not a, that's not an r slash whoosh. That's just, that's just a wholesome post. Yeah, I think, 
I think I want to leave this video off on a wholesome, wholesome post. That's not a whoosh. Okay, that's not a whoo. That's actually something really wholesome. And I'm all for wholesomeness. So, I'm going to leave this video off here so that we can end it off on a good note. If you guys did enjoy, however, if you guys enjoyed seeing everyone whose heads jokes flew over, I don't know how to say that. I don't, I'm sorry. Then, make sure you leave a like. Smack! I'm sorry, smash that subscribe button and leave a comment, let me know what your r slash whoosh moment was in your life, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.